Hello everybody, this is Kill Me Hood. Welcome back to Dragon Age 2. And now uh, I got some more stuff, so I got a whole ass grenade here. Just fire damage, okay, okay. Uh, and I get any of these because I don't have enough stuff. I can do this, restoration potion. Oh, whatever. Arrow, there, and the Fenris. So now I got I got new quests. I got the wounded coast thing, and I've got this low town at night thing. So I'm a little upset about something here, guys. I tried to go onto the Dragon Age tapestry today to uh, you know input what I've done so far in there so that I can have my world state updated whenever I go to play Inquisition and it just refuses it just refuses to connect so if I have to do this tomorrow I'll be upset here miss word is you're looking for help and paying well I need someone native to the dark places beneath Lowtown if you claim as much yes I will pay I am I am Let's just step into this alley, and me and my fellows can have a look at the money on offer. She has chosen poorly. It does appear she could use some help. Yeah, really. Especially now. Yeah, she's an idiot. <laughs> Thank you for your timely intervention. I am out of my element. A foolish risk in Lowtown. I had to come here to get the type of person I need. Someone of bloody skill, but also integrity. Perhaps the kind who might leap to someone's defense. I have a charge who needs passage from the city. If you are willing and capable, meet me at my safe house nearby. You make a lot of assumptions. It almost got you killed already. All the more reason to end this quickly. You must need coin. Everyone here does. Varnell! Not so helpless, I see. I hope you will come. This matter only grows more urgent with time. Ah, uh, shut up. Hey, where am I going now? Here the low town bazaar. Oh, we're by Gamlin's house, cool. I'm expected. I thank you for coming. Like this matter is doing? delicate, and I need someone of limited notoriety who will not link this to me. It is an escort, but I think you will agree the nature of the party makes this unique. If this is criminal, is I illegal? already have enough trouble. I should think you're about to have more. I am Sister Patrice. This is my burden of charity. Shiva Da. Would even a Templar bind a mage like this? A survivor of infighting with their Talvashoth outcasts. I call him Katojin, a bridge between worlds. The Viscount and others feel that peace begins with appeasement. This mage would likely be returned to his brutal kin. He can serve a better purpose. I want him free. He must be guided from the city without alerting his people, or being seen in my care. You don't just you stumble on him? something, someone like this. How? For all their blasphemous certainty, the Kunari do have deserters. Those who seek freedom are hunted mercilessly. Talvashoth, they seem to accept the role. Even their rebels conform. Savonel observed one of their bloody exchanges. 
This poor mage was the only survivor. And you think this mage was being hunted? I am certain no thinking creature would willingly submit to this. If he was not running before, he has seized the opportunity now. Will he help? If I trust him at all. I don't know his capabilities, or if he can function at all in that collar. But I think he knows we are his only way out. You think? He's followed every direction and made no aggressive moves, even when taunted. Were I in his place, I could have fled. Kunari or not, I can only assume he wants to be led to freedom. And if you're wrong, I have to deal with it. That is why I went to Lowtown. You are either capable of the discretion and skill that I need, or you are not. I can appeal to the uh, I have dealings airshock. with the Kunari leader. He'd want to know of this. You have dealt with their leader. If you have interacted with Kunari, you know how they treat those who leave their heathen order. The Arashok would doom this poor creature. But knowing them is useful. If they challenged you, attacking an ally would only confirm their barbarism. You are still right for the task. I can get him out of Kirkwall. He's a bit conspicuous for the streets, though. Why would they do this to him? That is obviously not an option. You must avoid incident with the guards. I cannot be linked to this. This mage will be a fine example of how cruel Kunari are, even to their own. But only if this plays out just so. The passage here leads to the warrens of the Undercity. It is dangerous, but that is why you were hired. Good luck. Varric, shut the fuck up, dude. I think you've got enough coin together to get in on the expedition. We ought to go see my brother. Am I gonna have a problem with these guys? Like, am I gonna have a problem with everybody? I already got a problem with Fenrir. Oh, that's fair. Spiders! Spider web. Spider. I feel like uh, Katosian doesn't want to actually be here. He's not very helpful, is he? He's chilling. Ah, look at this. Undercity is feared by all, but there's no shortage of fools with coin who want to test it. What is this thing? Collared like a dog lord's bitch. He's some sort of canary lover. Maybe I should get rid of you and see who will pay the most for your pet. Uh, I don't think it likes you threatening its master. Maybe we let this one pass. Do everyone a favor and listen to your friend. Unless you lot make a holiday of the last free place in Kirkwall, tax it up like even Lowtown, I'll cut you up and save the biggest piece for your pet. By the void! Kill it! Kill them all! Yeah, we're gonna kill you. 
That's what your pick was gonna happen. You're attacking a mage. The danger has passed, Katojan. Calm your <laughs> Keep control, and remember who is on your side. <sighs> of course. I expected no different. Yeah, your tongue's cut out, so I mean... It's hard to talk to you anyway, Katojin. My recording software is having a problem right now. Hope everything sounds all right and I'm not like delayed by two seconds or whatever. So that's what it looks like it's happening. Probably audio's desynced or some crap. I won't be upset. You will hold Basra Vashidan. I am Arvarad, and I claim possession of Sarabas at your heel. The members of his Karatom were killed by Talbashoth, but their disposal leads only here, to Sarabas and you. I just got here, coming from the other way. If there was a trail, I didn't leave it. Yet you are here with Sarabas. The crime is his freedom, his leash held by unknowing Basra. We will not allow that danger to continue. Let your own mages doom you. Sarabas will be properly confined. And if he doesn't want to go back? Sarabas, show that your will remains bound to the Kune. <laughs> he has only followed you because he wants to be led. He has allowed no other purpose. He is bound and abused, and you want him caged. Why? The power that he has, that all Cerebos have, draws from chaos and demons. They can never be in control. So you fear them? Just like everyone. We leash Cerebos because they are dangerous and contagious. Not even your Templars fully grasp that threat. I find Meryl. it hard to believe that Meryl could be so threatening. Thank you, Hawk. There's no need for such fear. You are Sarah Bas? Bas Sarah Bas? Vashedan! Neira Setar Karasam! You spewed your words at me like a demon trying to poison my control. Like this mage, the cube requires your death. But we're no threat. To I each literally other. do not care. Boss Sarabas, you will be no threat to any. <laughs> oh. That happened, but I mean, it happened. Get back. Can you stand? Deserve honor. You are now Basvaran, worthy of following. I thank your intent, even if it was wrong. I know the will of Arvarad. I must return as it demanded. It is the wisdom of the Kune. 
So after all of this, now you want to die? I do not want to die. I want to live by the cube. Which means dying. Yes. Is that hard to grasp? Arvarad couldn't kill me. Perhaps he was wrong about your death, too. Losing to you does not make him wrong. He spoke the Kune. I have chosen. It is bred in the bone. Existing is not a choice. It is the only choice. As it tell Eb, it is to be. Could you have returned if I'd let these others live? No. You were doomed from the start. I was outside my Keratom. I may be corrupted. I cannot know. How I return is my choice. It must be. But that does not mean there is no meaning. My job ended when we exited the city. The rest is up to you. You know of certainty and borders. You are closer to the Kunari than you admit. Your role would change little if you accepted the Kun. Take this secret thing, Vasvarad. Remember this day. That was all right. It wasn't, was it? She may not have known about this, but clearly yeah. Patrice set a trail right to us. If she sent them on us. Blood magic. I would know why. These guys. I do need that though. I think that's a plant. Nope, bones. Somebody's bones. Look, somebody died standing here, sitting down. That's silverite. That is silverite. I'll keep that. Oh, ho, ho. I go back to Sister Patrice. Patrice. Wherever the fuck she is. Probably in that same hole that she was hiding in last time. Hey, Katojin's dead. Not my fault. He did it to himself. The Harriman family's been throwing a lot of coin around. Trying to find out. Leave nothing. It must be clean with no ties. It. Well, my helpful associate from the streets. You took the Kunari from the city? Without incident. I think the incident was rather your idea. Mind your tongue, dwarf. Please, do speak your mind. The bodies of the mages Karatar led right to us. Why? You come back speaking their language and think to lecture me. If such a plot existed, if the Kunari had murdered you for trying to help their slave mage, then yes. Someone might have found that useful. It would have cast doubt on appeasement. Perhaps your death would have been a tragic necessity. Perhaps finding the mage was a rushed opportunity. But all we have now are dead Kunari and the word of a sympathizer. 
Your Ketogen killed himself rather than be free. I assumed he wanted to escape, just as I would. My pity is genuine, but they are not like us. If, perhaps, why dance around this lie? I'm standing right here. If a member of the Chantry admitted instigation, I have no doubt it would result in more appeasement. But an accusation from a low town thug, you are hardly that important. That's not an insult. It's why I chose you. Rest assured, excuses, real or imagined, are not for your benefit. I have no allegiance to Kunari. You lost a potential ally. Perhaps, but I will not risk these kinds of relationships again. Take your pay and be gone. I am new to this, I admit. But someone has to think of eternity. The peace will not last. Eternity. Oh my god. She'll be yeah, trouble. not if you're around trying to make it worse. Dumbass. She's horrible. Big strength. Big strength or pain. I should have went in Berserker and not Reaver. Oh well. Oh well, what's done is done. Take your sweet time, Jesus Hawk. Okay, we'll go do Act of Mercy now. No one leveled up, but I got three tactic slots somehow. I don't understand. Stuff and things for me? Stuff? No stuff? Pile of bones? That's where they want me to go, so I'll go the long way around. I'll eat this corpse. I found coral in him. This man's was eating coral.
corpse. Open. I stole his pants. Or her pants, I didn't really look. I stole their pants. Thrask? Sir Thrask? What are Master you doing here, my good man? Ariane tells me you sought a better path than the circle for her son, Fainriel. I thought perhaps you would be willing to show mages a kindness once more. Can I get the details before I agree? There are a number of apostates hiding in those caverns. I was hoping you might speak to the group. Convince them to surrender peacefully before my fellow Templars arrive. Who are these apostates? Where did they come from? These are the mages of the former circle at Starkhaven. It burned to the ground and their Templar sent for us to relocate the survivors. Unfortunately, they escaped on the journey. With their phylacteries burned, it has been nearly impossible to track them. Do the other Templars intend to do worse than recapture the mages? Sir Caress is a Knight Lieutenant of the Templars, a great crony of Meredith. Should he find apostates hiding from pursuit, Meredith will consider him justified in murdering the lot of them. Who's Meredith? You have clearly not been in Kirkwall long. Meredith is yeah, Knight like Commander. Month. She has changed the rules nah, for mages like in Kirkwall. They are less free than elsewhere. Though I dare say she has created as much dissent as obedience. I would not like to see this become a massacre. Thank you. Your compassion does you credit. These mages have shown they attack Templars on sight. I'm trying to get Fenris to be You have a better chance than I big to convince them they are better off alive in the circle than free and dead. Sir Karas hunts them as well. If they have not surrendered by the time he arrives, this will be a bloodbath. Oh, really, Fenris? Bro, stand up straight. You are you are all hunchback, Fenris. Like Meryl's standing up straighter than I am. This man's got his chest all puffed out. I'm going in there. Oh, dead people. Skeletons. Hey, 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 hey. Kill them. Mages will always resort to the forbidden if they feel enough need. You know, Fenris is right about that. I've seen that quite a few times. They're like, oh, oh my god, I really need to have something happen. And then they're like, yeah, I'll make a deal with the devil. Like, yeah, thanks. Two level ups. Meryl. Let's get your willpower up there. I'll do that. Let's get your cunning up more. Get you a new archer thing. Get him a new archer thing.
Let's shit full. I'm gonna need a new, uh, I'm gonna need to sell stuff. Real bad. I haven't sold anything yet. <laughs> Jesus. Maker's blessing. I thought I was going to die down here in this... this tomb. Are you with the Templars? Please, I need to go back to the Circle. I never wanted to get involved in this. Not when he started making those... those... things. Who is he? Decimus. It was his decision. He kept saying the Templars would label us blood mages if we fled. Why not use it if it's our best tool? Typical excuse. He slit his wrist, and the magic, it rose from the blood and woke the skeletons in the cave. I ran. Decimus is wrong. Blood magic is a work of evil, not just a power the Templars keep from us for spite. The Templar Thrask is waiting outside. Surrender to him, and you won't be hurt. I surrender. Take me to the Templars. I don't want anything to do with this blood magic. The rest of them, they're still following Decimus. He's gone mad. I think he'd kill us all just to take the Templars down. I mean, probably. Out of my way. That doesn't open. God, yeah, I really need to go to the shop. I'm at like 60 out of 70 on my backpack right now. There's so much. They're here. The Templars have come to take us back to the circle. Decimus, no. Stay your hand. These are no Templars. What do I care what shield they carry? If they challenge us, the dead themselves will meet the call. Stop attacking the damn scouts and attack Destiny. Listen to me, love. You, you are one of us. That you wear no mark of the circle. How is it you side against your own? Do you not see the pointy ears and tattoos? I'm Dalish. You are not my own. Decimus gave us the courage to face the Templars. Without him, we would be prisoners still. He obviously meant a lot to you. He was our future. Until he came, we never thought to fight back. I told Decimus he was going too far, but he said it was the only way to protect us, to protect me. Are we supposed to believe that you had no part in his actions? I swear to you, I have had no truck with demons. Please, we only want our freedom. Without your help, the Templars will execute us all for Decimus's crimes. What do you ask of me? There is a Templar who followed us. You must have met him when you entered. Kill him, and we can get clear of Kirkwall before the Templars see more men. I am not men. killing Sir Thrax. We should help them. We don't know what this good-hearted Templar truly intends to do. Yes, let's murder a Templar. Surely that will help. Will you buy us time to flee Kirkwall? Leave it to me. By the time I'm done, these Templars will swear that the sky is green. Your confidence almost makes me believe you. But I spent two weeks traveling with these Templars. They strike first and think after. 
They are far easier to kill than to fool. I hope you know what you're doing. Well, okay, see, see, I did the right dialogue choice, even though I'm pissing Fenris the fuck off. It's gonna be, it's gonna be a thing with him later. Ah, well, whatever. It's gonna be a thing with him later, but it's gonna be a funny thing with him. Magic resistance. That's pretty damn fucking cool. If he's got magic resistance. Yeah, no, he, I'm giving him that magic resistance. That's ridiculously overpowered. I have to walk all the way back. Is there an easy way out of here? We will speak no more. I would not wish any I just want to get out of here and start a fire. Because I gotta walk the whole way out. God damn it. Here we go! Can there be no more corpses? Please? Can there be no more corpses? Sir Thrask! Sir Thrask! Are you trying to tell me this boy is all that's left of the apostates? I ran away when they began to use blood magic, sir. They are not in the cavern, Sir Karas. I have thoroughly explored. Who is this? Tell him who we are. I'm astonished Sir Thrask didn't mention that Sir Hawk, Knight Lieutenant of the Order in Ferelden, was here at the Knight Commander's personal invitation. Uh, yes. Yes, I was just about to tell him. We've completed our investigation of the mages in those caverns. There is no one left inside. The apostates resorted to blood magic and ended up turning on each other. Their leader fled the battlefield ahead of us. Bloody coward left his own people to die. I uh, caught only a glimpse, but it looked like the back passages led out to the coast. I sent your men that way. We can still catch up if we go around the caverns. That's the faster route. The coast, you say? Men, fan out, search the shore. We will retrieve these corpses later. I will commend you to the Knight Commander, Sir Hawk. Thank you, my friend. I didn't think you could do it. Truly, you must be able to charm a miser out of his last coin. I did not think any of us would leave those caverns alive. It won't be an easy path, Aye, where are you trying to go? live free as a mage. But it will be go? my path. Please, accept my staff as a reward. It has the mark of Starkhaven on it. I dare not carry it now. It should bring a good price. Now, we must flee as far as we can before nightfall. Thank you, friend. You're welcome. I'm sorry, Fenris, that you hate whatever I'm doing all the time. Jesus, dude. Fenris absolutely hates what I'm doing here. Like, I'm sorry that you're a little whiny bastard that doesn't want to... What that doesn't trust any mage whatsoever.
Is that all I have left is high town thing? Alright, well I'm gonna go to high town in the day so I can sell some shit. Hey, Hubert's fine goods. Yeah, I took that. What about it? I have one ability point. That disappeared on me. Always a pleasure, huh? See, now I have delirium for this stuff. I, I don't understand gambling. Why you always have crap here? There's another. Life of Bethany. It's all about Tamra. One on the desk. Alright, well, I'm all out of time for this episode today, everybody. I guess we'll do the Anders quest next time. So, you know. <laughs>